Hi guys, Artie here and I have another update on Adult Swim's Checker Pass block for the first time since December. Ever since last week, the lineup has degraded and now we only have Dexter's Lab, Courage, Ed and Nettie, and Cow and Chicken airing on the block. They removed Billy and Mandy and Evil Kong Carney in favor of airing each show for an hour. This is something I knew that was going to happen from the start. Classic Cartoon Network shows only have so many episodes, and each show has aired its entire rotation several times already. Why not air the specials like Ed and Nettie's Big Picture Show, or Dexter's Lab Ego Trip? I'm pretty sure they've only aired Billy and Mandy Save Christmas and Wrath of the Spider Queen, and not any of the other specials like Underfist that haven't aired in years. Recently, they vaulted Billy and Mandy, and it is not airing on the channel at the moment, but I'm sure it'll be back eventually. So right now, Checker Pass is only airing Dexter's Lab and Courage for most of the week, and we only get an hour of Ed and Nettie and Cow and Chicken on Friday. I'm guessing Billy and Mandy was too new for Checkered Past? Probably not the case here. There's gotta be another reason why it was removed besides rotation. Something I notice is that there have been no Cartoon Network originals from the 2000s airing on Boomerang since President's Day. So potentially, we could be getting shows like Foster's Home, Kids Next Door, and Flapjack on Checkered Past in the future. I wish they didn't remove the CM theme night on Boomerang, but hopefully those shows will find a new home soon. I also hope this block doesn't suffer the same fate Nick Rewind did, or it becomes oversaturated with the same few shows playing over and over again. At least in Nick Rewind's last few months of existence, there was a notice on the bottom left-hand corner of the screen advertising the shows on Paramount+. Plus. Meanwhile, with Checkered Pass and Cartoon Network content in general, the shows are spotty and hard to find and scattered across all kinds of streaming services. Wouldn't it make more sense to host all the CN and Adult Swim series exclusively on HBO Max? Maybe Hulu and Tubi for the more obscure shows? That would be too easy. You know there's a problem when it is easier to binge your favorite shows through piracy, rather than legitimate platforms because either there are episodes missing or the show isn't hosted anywhere at all. Not endorsing piracy either, just making a point. There's no point in having a full hour for each show because Fridays were originally reserved for a marathon of a select show, or use the showcase lesser aired newer editions like Evil Kong Carney and I Am Weasel. I don't mean to be pessimistic here, but this could be the first stage of decline for Checker Pass, unless they add more shows, expand the weekends, or expand to the 7pm hour. I'm glad they are airing older series, but there's more than four classic Cartoon Network shows they can air, especially if they're going for pre-2004 cartoons. I've mentioned this before. Maybe the lineup will go downhill from here, or maybe it'll improve. Contrary to popular belief, it was not doomed from the start and was doing excellent until now. It's all about what direction they decide to take it in. They gradually introduced a few more shows and took baby steps, and that's what Checker Pass should continue to do, rather than pulling one show to make room for an extra rerun for the others. Only time will tell. Before I close out, you know about those ideal fan-made schedule charts I make about once a month? Where I tinker the schedule not only to my liking, but optimize it with more variety, give hindered shows the spotlight, and fix the bad aspects. I made one for Adulsome, and as you can see, I expanded Checkered Pass to another hour and included shows that I believe would be fit for the block. Not just that, on Friday, Checkered Pass is followed by classic Adulsome shows like Cole Movies and The Oblongs. I was gonna add Harvey Birdman, Attorney of Law, but I overlooked it. I had fun with making the Friday lineup. It would be a crime not to mention or include Robot Jones on Checkered Past. Especially since the announcer voice for the block is very similar to the character. I also included SWAT Cats and Two Stupid Dogs, since it was a cornerstone for early Cartoon Network and Boomerang isn't airing them at the moment. Last but not least, Samurai Jack would be perfect for Adult Swim, and I've been saying this since the block's inception in August. Especially since the final revival season in 2017 aired on Adult Swim, and I'm surprised it hasn't been shown recently. It's a more action-oriented and story-driven show. I can't wait to make another fan-made schedule chart next month. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, notify, and check out other videos on the channel. You may like them. What are your thoughts on Checker Pass at the moment? Are there any too few shows in spamming courage? Let me know in the comments.